Hello and welcome uh, to today's Wilcom uh, video short series for Embroidery Studio E4.0. Uh, my name is James. Today I'm going to show you how to properly bring in a, a machine file like your DST files. Uh, and uh, we're going to open up here with the um, program as I navigate uh, to the file drop menu. So I'll have click. I'm going to choose open. I'm here. Uh, you have your options here to go in. Normally, um, we would just double click on this file to open it up. In E4, we made some uh, adjustments uh, so that uh, this time you'll need to go in and just left click it once. Okay. And then you'll navigate down to the bottom and choose options. You want to make sure uh, that here that your objects and outlines are selected. And you want to make sure also that the auto connectors here are, are is uh, checked also uh, in order to turn those automatic features on for this particular design. So it would be uh, easier for you to go in and edit uh, this file. So I'm going to uh, click here and here to turn those on. And what I can do now here also is I can go in and I can uh, click OK. And now I can scroll down here to the bottom and I can open this file up. And once that file op opens up on my screen here, I should be able to see uh, these type objects here in my color object list. Okay, um, by turning on the outlines in the uh, auto connectors, um, you should be able to go in and edit um, most of these uh, objects here on the screen. Uh, the only ones that you won't be able to go in and physically automatically edit will be these type stitches here, which are the manual stitches. Okay, and um, that is um, how you would bring this file in. If you want to verify this to make sure that you have the correct grade of uh, design loaded, uh, you can always navigate up top here. Uh, you can left click here on your design properties. Once that uh, menu pops up over here, um, you will click on design. As you scroll down, you will see uh, the grade of this particular design here, which is the grade C, which is correct. Okay, um, if you just double click on the file and open it up without those options selected, this will be a grade D. Okay, and that is the, that is actually um, the worst uh, type file that you can bring in as far as uh, being able to edit that particular document. Okay, and so um, what that will look like if the automatic features are not turned on. Um, I'm going to close this out. Would be something like this. As I go in to File, I'll choose Open, and I will uh, choose the this design under my Options tab here. If these are not selected, and I go in and I open up uh, this file. Um, this is what I'll see in my color object list. These are all manual stitches. Uh, they are uneditable um, using the automation inside the software. Okay. Um, I, if I wanted to look at those to see what they look like on the reshape tool, I can select that and press H. And this is what that looks like with all manual stitches uh, in with the design. Do a control A. So this is what we have whenever we click on something here. Uh, th these are manual stitches and they're uneditable uh, as far as being able to use any of the automation inside the software uh, as far as just uh, increasing or decreasing the size and otherwise. Okay, um, That is going to do it for uh, this class. I thank you for your time. Uh, as always, we ask you to visit us at www.willcomeamerica.com. Thank you for your time.